Jack, welcome to Blackpool. How do you feel about signing? Yeah, obviously I'm delighted. Um, got the call the other day and uh, saw that was an option. And um, as soon as I heard it, I said I couldn't wait to get started. So obviously, been in this morning, trained, met all the lads, um, met the gaffer, and it's 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 been uh, been a quick turnaround. But uh, delighted to be here, and obviously delighted to be a part of of what's going to be with the club moving forward. Yeah, obviously Mark Howard injured at the moment. The manager's looking to strengthen that goalkeeping department. So good competition for places coming in. Definitely, we um, obviously know Mark through my brother, and um, obviously he got a nasty injury, so I still think he's a little while away. So, but there's also other good goalkeepers here, so it's down to competing for places. And I think when you come to, to top clubs, um, you're always going to have to compete for your place, and that's what I'm going to do. Um, I'll give everything I've got, and uh, hopefully, I play as many games as I can and uh, get as many wins as we can. We tend to have a good clean sheet record against Blackpool down the years. We open transfer it the other way around. I know, yeah, I always seem to have done well. It's always a place I look forward to coming to. I used to come here as a eight, nine, ten year old kid uh, playing in the Blackpool tournament, so it was always a place I used to love coming and playing. So I've got a nice little record here, so hopefully I can continue it. Um, but no, just just delighted to be signed and delighted uh, and can't wait to get started. Biggest attributes as a goalkeeper, would you say? It's a tough one. I, I, you, you ultimately say shot stopping because that's what you're there to do. Um, Obviously, my distribution can be a big part of things as well. Um, had a good good penalty record last year at, um, at Scunthorpe, so it's it, it's hard to pick out one attribute. But um, but I, I would kind of say my shot stopping. Obviously, last year you mentioned Scunthorpe. You played what 43 games there last year. So that's something you'll be looking to try and build on and get that number one spot here. Yeah, we, obviously it was um, it was brilliant for myself in terms of the games. Obviously, a disappointing season. Um, uh, a team that was low on confidence and uh, we, we couldn't quite get over the line but it, it was an experience um, and I, I had to use it as that. Um, ultimately I've been in a relegated team but I use that as an experience to move on and to learn things um, and if I can get anywhere near the same amount of games uh, here this season I'll be delighted. Um, obviously it's going to be a tough competition and um, and hopefully it's going to be a very good season so, so yeah, I can't wait to get down to work. Only ten days of pre-season left now. Where are you in terms of your fitness? Yeah, I feel good. I've um, obviously went to Portugal with Rangers. Um, I've sort of played a thirty minutes of forty-five and a ninety, so I'm feeling good. Obviously, it's going to be different with a with a different sort of team in front of me. So obviously, getting used to getting used to the lads. But um, I think ten days is is long enough. And I kind of I went to Scunthorpe five days in last time and embedded in quite well. So. I always keep my, myself fit all year round um, because as a goalkeeper, as you know, it's it's one of them positions that you can go from being nowhere near it to, to, to playing in front of thousands, so you've got to be ready at all times.